All right, here's the thing. Pop culture, like how does pop culture influence us? And how can I make art incorporating the concept of pop culture? Like what is pop culture? Like let's take a look at it and consider how each of these artists so I'm going to show you right now incorporate pop culture into their artwork. All right, here's a guy and he's playing a flute and there's a snake coming out of his boots. Well, there's a snake in my boot. Totally pop culture with Toy Story. Okay, here's a tattoo. That guy might have gone a little too far. He must really like the movie. But if tattoos are art. That's uh, pop culture and art coming together. Well, here's art and pop culture coming together also. It's the Mona Lisa. It's like a five, six hundred year old painting, but you know how you kids like to wear all those little funny cat ears and stuff around the school? Well, the Mon Mona Lisa wearing a cat. Okay, let's move on. Hey, that's that Batman's girlfriend, right? That's something in pop culture, but really the pose is from an older painting called The Girl with a Pearl Earring. So pop culture can really influence how we make art and art of the old can influence our pop culture today. Why is this lady yelling at this cat? I mean, is this art? It's a meme. I'm not sure. You can take and put a whole bunch of different sayings on there like, it's not pop culture. And then the cat says something really funny. Okay, here's a guy who uses pop culture, Snapchat, definitely pop culture. And what he does is he makes art every day and posts it to his Snapchat. And he gets a lot of followers that check it out. So pop culture just using a modern tool. Speaking of modern tools, this is an artist who makes these incredible things in Minecraft. I don't know how to play Minecraft. I think it looks like Legos. I don't know. Okay. So pop culture can be things that are around today that are popular, like Coca-Cola. But this guy took it and he made like this futuristic, like the world's end of the apocalypse and he's put the Coke can into it. It's kind of crazy. I mean, pop culture can just be used to make commentary like <laughs> this McDonald's guy. He's only going one mile, oh, zero. Is it one mile an hour? Or do you think it's 0 0.1? Yeah, it's probably one mile an hour. He's moving pretty quick. That's pretty good for a, for a McDonald's guy that just ate all those french fries. I hope he doesn't get sick to his stomach. So pop culture, you can use emojis and you can make art by just putting all the emojis together and creating a portrait. I mean, just think about your theme today. It's pop culture. How does pop culture influence you? And how can you make art incorporating the concept of pop culture? And that's the thing.